Guys, found something strange about this arrow. Yeah, Ivor, you know potions and enchantments and weird stuff like that. What do you make of it? Yeah, dude, what you got? It's a dildo. <laughs> Smells like... Yes. Potion of poison? Oh, is it a tipped arrow? Oh, I've heard of those. They're... they're still pretty new. Oh, nasty stuff. Using potions to make arrows. The possibilities are fascinating. Would you stop pointing that thing all over the place? You're making me nervous. You ever seen them used like this before? In a trap like this? No way. Could have sworn I saw someone doing a tutorial on how to make those not too long ago. <laughs> My nerves are too shot to remember who right now. Well, let me know if it comes back to you. Hello? Everything okay in here? Whoa! What's with the crowd? I, uh, I was just about to get everyone together to tell them at once. Okay. Hang on a minute. And you are? It's you. I recognize you. Excuse me? Uh, yes. What? It's a long story, but that's actually impossible. There's no way we could have met before. I'll show you. Follow me. Um, okay. Well then. Lizzie, hi. Did you see all these new... Oh! You've got them with you. Oh, <gasps> who the fuck are you? Well, first it was the portraits of the people already here, then poof, you guys. Whoa, that's unexpected. Yeah, no kidding. They're absolutely exquisite. Perfect. Well, not perfect. <laughs> absolutely perfect. Must have been when we showed up. This is so ridiculously creepy. Right? Yeah. At first I was like, oh cool, fan art, flattering. But the more I thought about it, creepy is definitely right. Well, that's definitely not a good sign. Come on, everyone. Let's huddle up in the dining room. Wonder if he told them yet. Can't wait to hear the big news. Me neither. Oh, hey, look. They matched their Ooh, portraits. This cake. Shocker. Guess not. Come on, let's do this. Come on, Winslow. Yeah. Here, let me introduce you all properly. You guys already met Cassie Rose and LD Shadow Lady. Uh, but my friends call me Lizzie. Cassie Stacey Rose. Plays Stampy Cat, and that's Dan, the Diamond Minecart. W when did your hair change color? <laughs> it? It's funny. Before you guys showed up, we all knew each other here. Their names Except are Jesse. Who the fuck Patrick, is Cassie Rose? Lucas, I don't recognize Ivor. that name. Something seems fishy you about you. That was news. Is it good? Good news. Everyone uh, knows Dan TDM yeah, and Sparkles. It's um bad news, I'm afraid. Who the fuck is Cassie Torque Rose? Dog I don't know you. Is dead. Good heavens! Oh, no. Wait, what? But Torque Dog was so tough. There was nothing that could take him down. What happened? Yeah, what on earth is going on here, Sparkles? Well, this is going well so far. I know, I know, it's a big shock. We're still trying to figure out the details of what's going on. I can't believe Talk Dog's gone. Just like that. No, I can believe it. I so saw it. What happened to his stuff? Whoa! How can you say that? What? It's a valid question. Whoa. Come on, everyone. Come on. Don't get greedy. Just. I want to know what happened. For curiosity's sake. Wow, that's a pretty cold question, don't you think? Well. Let's just say you didn't know Torque Dog like we did. So I'm looking at this situation. I'm trying to figure something out. Is this just about Torque Dog, or is there a bigger picture? Yeah. Why have our portraits? I don't know, guys. Yeah, seriously, we're not Dog, famous I Minecraft think this might YouTubers. Just be about him. Am I picking up some beef here? Uh, what? No. 
I don't know what you're talking about. There's something you're not telling me, Lizzie? Uh, no, sorry, that came out wrong. You know what? Forget I said anything. Well, someone brought us here for a reason, including Talk Dog. What if we're all in danger? Oh my gosh, Dan's right! Whoever's doing this, they could be hunting us! Hey, come on, everyone. If there's one thing I believe in, it's teamwork. If we all stick together and get through this as a team, we'll be fine. <laughs> Inspiring. There you go, Don't guys. Dick. Teamwork makes the dream work. Wow. Oh, all of this danger talk has my stomach all queasy. Stampy, come over here. I need to talk to you about something. That's Lizzie. not a good sign. Psst. Lizzie. That's also not a good sign. The more I think about it, the more I think that there's something these people really don't want us to know. One of them's gotta know the truth about what's going on here. It'd be nice to figure out what on earth is going on here. Especially if we're gonna be stuck with these people until dawn. Sounds like we've got a mystery until to solve dawn, people. That's a Luckily, video game. Detective anyway. Jesse is on the case. Let's get investigating then. Uh, I'm gonna talk to this crazy girl over here whose name I don't recognize at all. Hey, Sparkles and Cassie Rose, yeah? Yep, hi, that's me. <laughs> totally hey, real person. Oh, yep. Winslow says hi too. <laughs> you mind if I ask you guys some questions? Nope. What are the questions? There was drama between Lizzie and Torque Dog, right? Got any insight? Sorry, I'm not getting wrapped up in that. Especially now that Torque Dog is, you know. But it's weird, right? Definitely seems like there's some beef. Uh, not that I um, want to get into rumors or anything like that. Yeah, sure you don't. Got any guesses why someone would kill Torque Dog? Uh, gosh, gosh. Um, he was a little prickly around the edges, you know. You'd have to ask other people about that. I, I didn't really know him. Mm hmm I don't want to say anything mean about a guy that's not here to defend himself, but... Well, you met him, right? Prickly is kind of an understatement. Cassie, you seem pretty upset about people wanting to poke around Torque Dog's inventory. Oh, was I? Yeah, yeah, you were. Why was that? Well, it was just so... It's insensitive, right? I mean, it, it had just happened, and she was all curious about what was in his pockets. Just made me mad, I guess. Uh -huh, Sparkles, sure. Cassie, Winslow, thanks for the time. No problem. Yes, thank uh, you. Yeah, meow, meow, anytime. Get anything out of them? Found out this group has a whole lot of secrets they're keeping from each other. It's definitely something. All right, let's go talk to Stampy and Stacy. See what they got to say. Just gonna ignore Dan. Hey guys, Stampy and Stacy, right? Oh, um, uh, hello. Hey Jesse, what's up? I know things are a little nuts right now, but I've got some questions. Oh, really? Uh, but well, what? Stacy, you seem pretty curious about what was in Torque Dog's inventory. What's up with that? Well, Torque Dog was a pretty notorious thief. I was just curious what he had. That's it. Mm -hmm. Huh. Yeah, sure. Seems like Lizzie and Torque Dog really didn't like each other. Know anything else about that? All that. Real shame. Real shame. He broke into her house and stole a bunch of stuff from her. She was super upset about it. <laughs> Makes don't sense. Say. Anyone you can think of that would want something bad to happen to Torque Dog? Um, well, I never had that big of a problem with him personally, but I know other people did. Quite a few, actually. I don't he know says if you noticed, but towards them. he was a bit of a griefer. Yeah, and a thief. Thief, huh? Interesting. Thanks, you two. This has been enlightening. No problem. Yeah, no problem. So, did you find anything out from Stacy or Sturdy Cat? Stampy Cat? Right, right. So, did you find anything out? Apparently, Torque Dog was a well known thief. A thief, huh? That might have something to do with it, don't you think? Agreed. Yeah. 
So, Dizzle hey and Lizzie. There, Dan. What's up? Lizzie? Oh, uh, hello? Hi there. If you don't mind, I actually had some questions about this torque dog situation. Yeah? Go ahead. Lizzie, seems like you're not much of a torque dog fan. What's the deal? Oh, come on. You met him, right? Nobody liked that guy. I'm just the only one who will actually admit it. He, um, yeah, he definitely wasn't the nicest person. Hmm. So, Lizzie, I heard something interesting about you and Torque Dog. Yeah? What did you hear? I'm sure there are all sorts of rumors floating around out there. Lizzie, I heard he stole from you. Whoa, would you keep it down? Okay, yes, he did. He stole one of my creeper head trophies, my very first one. I just didn't want to mention it before because I didn't want to look guilty. Wait, hmm. creeper head? This isn't about Damn, the. No, not in front of. And no, I told you, I never had it. Uh. Dan, you seem surprised by Lizzie mentioning a stolen creeper head. What did you think Torque Dog had stolen from her? No offense, but I'm not sure I feel comfortable discussing it with you. Sorry. Seemed like people were really interested in seeing Torque Dog's inventory. Any idea why? An hmm. adventurer like him? He could have had all kinds of cool stuff. Uh huh. Torque Dog was clearly targeted with this trap. Why him? Well, he was bragging about having some kind of rare item. Wouldn't show it to anyone, of course. Typical Torque Dog. So this rare item that Torque Dog claimed to have? What can you tell me about it? We don't know exactly. Hmm. Yeah, sorry. Okay. Okay, that's it for now. Thanks. What'd you find out? It's all tangled up, but it sounds like Torque Dog claimed to have some sort of rare item. People thought it was something he stole from Lizzie, but all he stole from Lizzie was a creeper head. I didn't see anything like that in his inventory, though. Yeah, something's not quite adding up here. So, Torque Dog was a thief, and he supposedly had something rare, but I feel like there's still a piece missing. No one will tell me what this rare item is. Hmm. I, uh, I think I can shed some light on that situation, actually. Well, now my curiosity has peaked. He already had me at rare item. <laughs> oh, thank goodness someone's being direct with me. Thanks, Sparkles. Sparkles. There's a temple way out in the middle of nowhere. No one knows who built it, but it's been there forever. People have been trying to track down the temple's location for ages because they want this treasure. It's supposedly deep in its basement. Now, it looks just like an ordinary flint and steel, but it's actually super rare. It's got this enchantment on it. It can open portals to other worlds? Exactly. Wait, what? You know about the enchanted flint and steel? Uh, no. How did you know that? Did, have, you, have you seen it? Have you seen it today? I actually have one of my own. Really? Yeah, I do. Just used it a little no, while geez, ago to put get... Put that away. You, you can't just pull that out here. Okay. <laughs> you know, I had a theory about why you were here... And I, I think this might just prove it. Everyone? Everyone? We've all been freaking out, wondering why we were all brought here. Why uh, Torque Dog died? Uh, and Jesse has just uncovered a very important clue. What? I have. Really? Whoever killed Torque Dog, whoever invited us, they're after the enchanted flint and steel. Ah! Sparkles? Panic, 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 Not sparkles. Whoa, 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 hang on, hang on. This is awful. Terrible. Who was that guy? And there's no such 
such thing as white Don't pumpkin. The white pumpkins hanging all over the place. Uh, uh, uh. I don't like it. I really don't. The white pumpkin is our host. That's the host? Well, I'm not sticking around to see how the rest of this party 